Hi, I'm Matthias, working with Helvetas in Communications, and next to me is Jane Carter. Hi, Jane. Hi, Matthias. You're a senior advisor in natural resource governance, and you just came back from Ethiopia, right? That's right. I came back last week. Yeah, and um, well, there was a civil war in Ethiopia. We almost forgot about it because everyone is focusing on Ukraine. Um, what did you see there? It's right that there has been a civil war. I was up in the north this time, so that's um, close to where the hostilities were. There's a ceasefire at the moment, but you see um, there are a lot of men walking around with guns, and uh, there's rumors that uh, there might hostilities might start again, but it's not sure, of course. Yeah. Another big problem is the drought we had in the country. I think you saw that in your first visit in the country in March. Yes, in March I was me. down in the south, in the area of Burana, which is an area of pastoralists. Uh, and there I saw things which, uh, well, I've rarely seen before. Um, the drought is really very serious. Um, for the last three years out of five, there has been this drought. So people are really at the end of their resources. I can show you photographs on yes, my phone please. now. So here, I mean, you see, I just saw oh, dead terrible. animals lying around yeah. the place. And people were just, they were really quite desperate then already. And I met this time with the project manager, and he tells me that although the rain started, they were very late. When yeah. the rains come, it, of course, it cools, and the animals are so um, emaciated, they die of cold. Oh, huh? So terrible. here you see... So what do we do actually there as Helvetas? For this time, um, we've been involved in a destocking program. So that means buying up some of the animals before they actually die. So at least the farmers get some value from them. Huh? But okay. of course, we have other hum humanitarian interventions as well. Yeah. Okay. For all of you who want to learn more about the drought situation, uh, Jane has written a blog. You can click on the link above. And uh, what is your last message to our audience today? Of course, the humanitarian situation in Ukraine deserves attention, but the Ethiopians deserve attention too.